Welcome to the Landing Photography Department short video on importing your files into the computer. We can use sources like directly from your camera, your SDAC card, your flash drive, or maybe images you even have on your desktop already. But in this case, we're just going to use uh, the flash drive that's, that I have already plugged in. To start, of course, we launch Lightroom. We go up here and we click on this icon up here in the left-hand corner. We click on Add Photos, and uh, let's just go into pictures that I have right here. All right, and I this says Review for Import. I click on that, and you can see these are images that we did some while ago out in Alameda. Okay, now what we want to do is we want to select all of these photos like this. If we want, we can just select one, but let's do all of them. Select all, and we are going to simply click Add Three Photos, and uh, in a moment, you will see that all these come up. And once we get into Lightroom, you can go, you can use your arrow key, or you can use your mouse, or your touch screen, and look at the each individual image here, all right? Now, there's a lot of stuff that we can do in Lightroom, and we'll go into that uh, just very, very briefly here, just so you know, okay? Uh, look at how dark these shadows are. I'm going to go into light. See? Light. I'm going to grab the shadow slider, and I'm just going to open that up a bit. And look at that shadow open up. You know, you do that to taste. Uh, I might knock down this brightness a little bit by knocking down the highlights. I don't know. Maybe it works. Maybe it doesn't. Take some of the sting out of the image. But that's about all I'm going to do. So we can do that with all kinds of things. We can rotate it, change the level of it. Uh, there are all kinds of things that we can do in future sessions. But I'm going to export this one image right here. Okay? And so I'm going to go up here to where it says File. Export, and then you can look here at settings. I want to see where it says file type JPEG up here. You can have a bunch of different file types exported, but we want JPEGs, and then I want them small because it takes up less room on my computer. And there are some other options here we can go into another time, but we're going to export one photo. So I'm just going to put it on my desktop. Now, your, yours might look a little bit different. But in my uh, Mac, I can make a new folder, and I'm going to call it OL4 here. And I'm going to create that folder. And see it's highlighted. I'm going to click Export. And it's going to export that. I'm just going to get rid of this here for now. And you can see that right here, you open this up, and you can see that that image is in that folder. We'll see it in Photoshop, and there you are. Okay. Now, I'm just going to quit Photoshop, and what you end up with is just a folder, and you can drag and drop that into your Google Drive. And that's all there is to it. Thank you for your kind attention.